Hey guys, back again. This is MJ. In this video, I will show you users of F1 key to F12. So let's see what is the users of F1, F2, F3, or F12 keys users. So first, from the F1. So F1 is used for open the help center or support center. So here, just press F1 in your browser. It will open your help or support center. The same thing. It will work the many program like here. You in Word, you press F1. It will open your support and help center and f1 also used for to enter the cmos setup okay so then now f2 one of the best features of f2 is you can rename your file and folder quickly just select the file or folder and press f2 and just here rename that's it it's very one of the useful key so just rename by pressing f2 and it's also used for enter to cmos setting in windows pcs f3 I like the one best feature of F3 uh, to making the upper and lower cases here in the Word document. Just uh, select the word Word and press Shift F3 to make lower upper case as you can see here. So Shift F3 will work for lower and upper case. You can make capital and it will also work for search in your browser. Uh, just press F3. It will here open your search okay in many program it will work for search now f4 f4 commonly known for close the document or close the or active window or many program just press alt f4 to close the or active window or any program f5 everyone knows f5 the first option is refresh yeah you can refresh your windows pc by pressing f5 and is also used in Microsoft Word like searching or finding option or words. Just press F5 in Word document and you will get the find, replace and go to option. And it's also used for PowerPoint slideshow. When you're in PowerPoint, just press F5 to start the PowerPoint slide. Now the F6. F6 is work for select the URL address. So if you want to select the any URL address, just press F6 and here you can see the URL is selected. And in some laptop, F6 also work for reduce the volume of your system or speaker volume. Okay, so the next is F7. F7 is work uh, with the spell check and grammar check. In Microsoft Word, you can press F7 to check the spell as you can see here. So F7 is to check the spell and grammar and it also used for uh, increase or decrease your laptop speaker in some laptops okay and the next is F8 F8 is mostly used for safe mode so when you're going to start uh, your Windows PC in safe mode uh, restart your PC and press F8 and it will enter to safe mode and F9 F9 you, if you want to refresh your Word document, just press F9, your document will refresh, your Word document will refresh and in the Outlook, Microsoft Outlook, it will uh, help to send and receive email by using F9 key. Okay, so the next is F10. F10 is used for right click, as you can see here, in your document or uh, here in the your browser anywhere it will work for right click okay so if you want to right click anywhere without using mouse you can press F10 and it's also used in laptops for increasing brightness of laptop okay and the F11 F11 is used for full screen in anywhere in your browser just press F11 it will full screen and for exits press the same button like F11 and it will come to the normal mode so full screen and normal mode press F11 and the last and my favorite key is F12 so F12 has many options if you want to know your file location just press your F12 in Word document and it will show you the file location as you can see here press F12 to know the file location 
and you can also save as your file just pressing the same thing like F12 you can save as your file okay and in the browser F12 will work to open Firebox or debug tools look at that so here you can see you can open your debug tools in your browser okay and the last is when you're going to boot your lap or laptop or desktop F12 will work to enter the boot load like devices on your laptop or desktop like selecting your CD or DVD or your pen drive so F12 will work to access the list of bootable devices on your computer startup so these are some common and not, uh, best users of F keys in Windows PC I hope you get uh, you get something new or if you have any new a shortcut of about these F keys you can share in comment. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you very much.